um, Connie asked you to interview me, and um, uh, so I tried to think of what I've been doing lately, and of course I've been making bookmarks for various things, but I've also been doing some memorizing, and uh, uh, after the Christmas season, I uh, decided, uh, I've heard the Christmas story so many times, but I thought um, I would uh, memorize it, because I, my short-term memory is one of the things that bothers me, even though each age has its rewards and old age does too, uh, sometimes a short-term memory does bother me, so I memorized, uh, I've been trying to memorize it, and so uh, this year I heard the scripture uh, recited about the Christmas and, and about its meaning, and um, it, it it said that they it revealed that Jesus uh, is divine, but he's also human. So I'm going to memorize the uh, story of Luke 2, 120. So I'll recite it to you now. <coughs> and it came to pass in those days there went out a decree from Caesar Augustus that all the world should be taxed. And this taxing was first made when Cyrenius was governor of Syria. And all went to be taxed, every one to his own city. And Joseph also went uh, to, from Galilee, uh, from the city of Nazareth, into Syria, and into Bethlehem, which, which, uh, the city of David, which is called Bethlehem, because he was of the house and lineage of David, and to be taxed with Mary, his espoused wife, who was great with child. And so it was that while they were there, the time was accomplished that she should be delivered. And she brought forth her firstborn son and laid him in a manger uh, and wrapped him in swaddling clothes and laid him in the manger because there was no room for them in the inn. And there were in the same country shepherds keeping watch over their shop flocks by night. And an angel of the Lord appeared unto them, and the glory of the Lord shone round about them. And they were sore afraid. And the angel said unto them, Fear not, for I bring you good tidings of great joy, which shall be to all people. For unto you is born this day in the city of David a Savior, which is Christ the Lord. And this shall be a sign unto you. You shall find the babe wrapped in swaddling clothes, lying in manger. And suddenly there was with the angel a host, a multitude of the heavenly hosts, praising God and saying, Glory to God in the highest, and on earth peace, goodwill toward men. And after the angels had gone back into heaven, the shepherds said one to another, Let us go now even into Bethlehem and see this thing which has come to pass, which has been made known to us. And they went with haste and found Mary and Joseph and the babe lying in the manger. And when they had heard it, they made known abroad the saying which had been revealed to them concerning this babe. And all they that heard it wondered at those things which were told them by the shepherds. But Mary kept all these things and pondered them in her heart. And the shepherds went back glorifying and praising God for the things that they had heard and seen as it was told unto them. That was good. Mm -hmm. That's a lot to memorize. Mm -hmm. And again, she's 93, going to be 94 in May. And that's a lot to memorize. That was very good. This was our second video, and we're going to be posting several. If anybody has any ideas of questions you want to ask Mom, let me know. Mm -hmm. Got anything else, Mom? No, that's all.